How to Eliminate Plastic Single-use plastics are an ecological disaster that needs to be stopped. But how? We could ban plastics, but we need to do more than that. We need to make sure that the plastic is replaced with the most environmentally friendly alternative. And while some foods might transition to cans or cartons, most will likely end up in glass containers. Glass doesn't alter the taste, and it allows consumers to see what's inside. But not all glass containers are equal. Glass can be recycled or reused. Recycling glass means sorting, crushing, melting, remolding, and refilling. Reusing glass means washing and refilling, as we once did with soda and milk bottles. The glass containers you see in the supermarket today are nearly all designed to be recycled, not reused. This is the result of manufacturers creating custom shapes and sizes as a marketing strategy. Of the two approaches, reuse is a much more environmentally friendly option. Refillable glass containers, averaging 25 trips, consume 93% less energy than single-use glass containers. We need to transition not just away from plastic, but towards reusable glass. To do that, we'll first need to standardize the containers, wide mouth jars, beverage bottles, wine bottles, and so forth. Standardized containers are more easily washed and would allow for greater inventory flexibility since they would be interchangeable across vendors. Retrieval of empties could either happen at curbside pickup or by returning them to the stores. Standardization is where the government needs to play a crucial role, working with industry to establish the standards. And to help consumers make the wise choice, containers would contain an official environmental seal of approval. Once the standard sizes are established, environmentally responsible corporations will leap at the opportunity to showcase their product in the new containers. At that point, we will have finally started our transition away from plastic. We managed to live without disposable plastics in the past, and we can do it again. And while further regulations might be needed, establishing this glass standard needs to be the first step.